Can y'all guess what this shadow is, is is made from? I'll give you a hint. It's my favorite fighter, and it's not the F-22. I already made my- I already made the F-22. If you could guess, based off of the shape of the wings and the intakes being kind of separated, it's the F-15. I used so many reference photos and so many, like, diagrams to get the perfect orientation for it. And now I'm going to test it. <laughs> oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, got it, got it. This thing actually turned out extremely well in my mind, especially with the shadow. I mean, like, the colors and stuff, like the smoothness, smoothness is not that good, but the proportions are really well made. We're definitely going to need SAS. Didn't turn on wet mode yet, but I don't like it really matters that much yet. Okay, how well does it work out? Oh, dang. Okay, no. Hang on. Revert to the space plane hangar again. Um, I need, I need better engines. Hang on. Toggle mode. Toggle mode. Yeah, we're maxing out everything. I was actually trying to make a uh, MiG-21, then an F-86, then a uh, MiG-19. And I was like, no, because this doesn't look right. And then I finally settled on an F-15 because I was so inspired by the plane. I actually saw a MiG, or I'm sorry, no, not a MiG. I saw a MiG-15 in Poland a few days ago, and I saw a F-15 today and an F-86 today, so really lucky, I guess? I don't know. I know it doesn't actually have thrust vectoring. I'm just gonna keep it like that for a little bit. Holy crap. That's worrying. Oh, wow, it is so fast. Look at how powerful. Holy crap. Of course, it's not able to pull off all the, sp all the crazy maneuvers that most jets are able to pull off nowadays, but... It's, it's a fourth gen fighter, what do you expect? Ooh. Holy crap, bro. Would you look at the dang thing? Operational. I actually think it's going on really well. Alright, let's try to land it. Yes, I know, in the grass. Dang it. That actually kind of jump scared me, though. Not gonna lie. It bounces a lot. <laughs> Actually, wait, no. First, let's make sure... Space plane hammer. First, let's make sure we don't have any thrust vectoring. Just the normal... No. Locked. Okay, it's all... That's... That's good. Um... Anything else I would like to add to it? I can't think of anything. Oh, let's make a little bit of... Let's make a little, uh... Let's make some little... Whatchamacallits? Rockets. Yes. Or, uh... What I mean to say is... Missiles. Or actually, no. Bombs. I think bombs would be a better way of saying it. Tiny bombs. Let's do... I need a radial coupling.
pretty sure one of its hard points is right there. I could be wrong, but... Move some symmetry. Okay, so we do Fox 1 and Fox 2. Okay. No, I don't need symmetry like that. What the heck? What the heck is that? What would this be better? Maybe let's get the other one. No, not that one. That's the kickback. Actually, no, it's like, it's like perfect size almost, but yeah, it's really long. <laughs> Would the hammer work? No, that's way too large. Flea? Nope, still too large. Separatron? No, too tiny. Clydesdale's extremely big. No, no, no. I guess we're going to have to go with the shrimp engine. It's not ideal, but it's... Kind of, kind of necessary. Unfortunately, I can't do any of the symmetry how I would want. That is so annoying. Like, extremely annoying. Shrimp, shrimp. Actually, wait. Can we... We can set it like that, can't we? I think that'll work out fine. Okay, let's try it now with putting the nose cones on. Okay, so we've got the nose cones. Now all we need is a little test flight. Should we, is there anything I could do to make it better? Eh, no. This. Let's try to fire at the buildings. <laughs> well, let's see how this goes. Oh, this is gonna be so funny. Definitely not, definitely not as maneuverable as some other fighter jets I've made, but more reliable. Alright, let's see, let's see, let's see. Can we do it right? Fox 1. Oh, it's so crazy. Okay. Space plane hanger. I'm gonna do like a little 
little tri stack, or not not tri stack, a uh, tri radial. Score it so that it will. Try it now. Bro, it has to be so insane. Wait, hang on. Wait a minute. Now we maybe we can try. Closer in. No, because that looks just weird. I guess we're going to have to do something else, but I don't know what to use, to be honest. Are these too big? Well, maybe not. Hang on, I might be able to get them to not clip with each other. They are literally twisting in each other. That is weird. What about if I do it like that and then... No, because it's still going to be clipping inside of the F-15's intake. Actually, wait, is that better? It is. It's actually a lot better. I found out how to do it. But it's definitely going to take a while to finish. Is it in? Dang. I think this was actually the, uh,
Yeah, this was the option I chose to use. Well, I'll continue working on this. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.